Hey guys, it's Avia, or Jeanette, or Pony Peep, or Xavia4563, whatever you want to call me, I really don't care. I'm making a video today to show you my models because everyone's been asking me, oh, do you still have briars? Do you have briars for sale? No, I don't. Not at the moment, okay? Because I sold them all to Fox Glory. Yay. So some of you, if you're friends with Fox Glory on Facebook, would be aware that I sold her like 15 horses and so that basically diluted my collection a bit or the collection of horses I'm willing to sell so I'm going to stop rambling and I'm just gonna show you what I have and if you're really that interested in buying something tell me and we'll talk but I'm not gonna promise that I'll sell it to you because these horses have sentimental value there are some other bodies like horses that have been played with or used for filming that I might be willing to sell. But these guys, like, really give me a good reason. Okay, yeah. So, anyway, I'll start the tour. You should know I'm filming this with my computer, which is a horrible idea, but I'm too lazy to get my camera. So, yeah. Okay, so we're going to start out with the first shelf. And the first shelf basically consists of my color-coded horses. So, we're going to open this. I hate how they sound when they open, so... Just so you know. Um, okay, so let's start out with the first row of Brilliant Horses. And um, I'll just explain briefly. Some of these have won Nans when I showed them, but most of them didn't. And yeah, so that Arabian horse right there was won with a competition of some sort. I don't remember. These horses are pretty awesome. Um... The one, the side one, is from the Saddle Club girls, the actresses, and these are them. And these are all show quality. They aren't played with. And then, um, these guys who are all very pretty. And as you can see, I love that mold right there quite a lot. You'll see a lot of those. Oh, and another thing. The ones on the very top row, those are like my all-time favorites, so don't ask. Please, spare yourself. Just don't ask me because I'm not going to sell them. Everything below the top row is as I discussed prior to this part of the video. Okay. The etched horse is from a stand at Briarfest where the lady nearly assaulted me because she hates me after I tried to buy the horse for like $10 less. It was uber expensive, which sucked. Um, but I still love that horse because the etching is amazing. And these horses, especially Party Girl, because she has amazing shading. Like a boss. <laughs> and then, um, okay. That was the first quarter. Um, the second part, um, the horses I sold Fox Glory I sold, sorry, I sold Fox Glory. Used to be down here, so it's like empty. But these are some of my favorite horses, especially him. He's so pretty. Um, and there are those guys, especially him. He's also very pretty. And let's see. This Pinto horse is beautiful, and you can't really see, but this rearing horse is also pretty. Awesome. He's one of my favorites. Okay. They make loud noises, these doors. And so, um, uh, let's see. This is the less awesome part of my collection, but it's still pretty awesome. Templado's color is pretty cool to me. I love it. This guy is so pretty. He's like, awesome. And there are the other white horses. And then there are these horses. So, nothing like fantabulous or anything, but pretty cool nonetheless. Um, let me see. There's my computer. Um, these guys I'm very proud of. Hank was really hard to find. I bought him with my best friend. Matrix, or The Matrix, or whatever his name was, was my first Briarfest purchase. And this guy right here was just hard to find at 
the Holiday Inn, and that's where I ended up finding him. And then there are these people. And then there are these paints. They're rather easy to find, actually, but yeah. The coochie is signed. Um, and then there are these guys. And one is a stone. The other one is, yeah, they're all briars after that. And, yeah. Okay. And then the last and final row with my all-time favorites again are Sundance. Um, who's amazing. This horse, which is iridescent, and my best friend got the opposite version of him. And then this, oh, I was talking about that one. And then this uh, paint horse right there is a custom. And then this one is just awesome. Albarazzo, or however you say that, um, is pretty cool, because he's rare. And then this last horse won like 20 nans or something. I haven't counted recently, but I got him at Briarfest, and the lady just gave me all of his nans. So I was like, what? Pretty awesome. And so, that's my collection. Um, I felt like I needed to make this video because I haven't made something in like so long and it was beginning to physically pain me. Um, okay, to so those who asked, I'm not making the series remember. First of all, I don't have a pool because I moved like three years ago. Second of all, I really don't want to make it because I don't make brighter videos anymore. And I'm working two jobs. So I don't have time. <laughs> I'm trying to buy a car. So yeah. Um, anyway, I hope you enjoyed this odd, unusual tour. And I hope it wasn't a waste of like seven or eight minutes of your life. Okay, so. Awesome sauce! So, just comment.